Hey everyone, welcome to Meet the Characters for Agents of the Nine Hells Redux. Oh, it's gonna be good. I'm excited. Are you excited, Bree? No, I'm really excited. <laughs> I'm here with Bree, and we're gonna make Bree's character. Bree, I haven't got a name for your character yet. What, what's what's the name? The name is Lua. Lua. Lua, mm -hmm. um, he, she, they? He. He. Nice. Mm -hmm. So, Hero Forge is really detailed, loads of great stuff we can do with Lua. What, what kind of species is Lua? Where are we looking? Uh, I was thinking high elf high for this. High elf, okay. Mm -hmm. Now in terms of elf, we've got the very elfy elf. Ooh, okay. We've got the sort of half elf. Okay. But these are just bases. We can do whatever we want here. There's a lot of freedom in the creator, but do you want to start with the basic elf or the basic half elf? Let's do the basic elf for basic now. Basic elf, sweet. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now there's a lot of head choice and I can't convince you with uh, Scarab. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, I'm good. Uh, oh, I really like them. I can't wait. Now I'm playing a Thrykreen's now an option again. That's a Dark Sun reference, which fans of ours will know all about. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> all right, so with our elf, this is a sort of basic starting point. We can do all the different faces. We can have mm -hmm. all the different permutations. Now, I'm obviously doing the screen here, so if you tell me like second from the left, uh, third from the bottom, that sort of thing. Okay. Is there a face that leaps out at you that says this one, this one in particular? Ooh, um, just, hmm. Zombie head. Let's go fourth, fourth or down. Mm -hmm. The second one in. Okay, yeah, 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 I'm feeling that. Nice. I'm feeling yeah, that. Yeah, cool. Yeah. Now, there's a softness slider here, which tends to delineate into sort of mask femme, but... Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, he definitely has uh, sharper features. Sharper features, so more towards this end. Mm -hmm. Cool, mm -hmm. cool, cool. Okay, start there. Uh, he's been given the sort of classic elf ears. There are some of the more, like, really long fey ears. <laughs> <laughs> or some of the slightly okay. spikier elemental ears, if you want to, like, because elf ears are already, like, different ears. We can now go to town. Mm -hmm. Like, there's gnome ears, which I think are a bit bigger. Yeah, they I are. Can't, oh, wait, the, down, the, the, the ones that go down. Yeah, the goblin ears. Wait a minute. Oh, oh my god. god. Yes. Like a moon yes. elf, like, like a sort of World of Warcraft moon elf, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they're great. Awesome. Let's keep those in. Uh, the head, I've given you one of these, like, Dashing, dashing hell. <laughs> but there is there is everything under the sun in here. Do you have a particular vibe you want to go for? I was thinking just like short curly hair. Short and curly? Yeah. That's a fro, no. Like that, like cross cropped, like a military cut? Kind of, yeah. Uh, is there something like a little bit longer? Greek, very Greco Roman? Ooh, okay, okay. <laughs> Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. I'm Something just thinking about his personality. Uh, tied up at go, the back. Go down one row mm -hmm. and then the second one in. Sort of a bed head. Yes. Yep. Yep. There nice. It is. Cool. Lovely. Excellent. Does he have a beard? He does not. Does he have? He's he is angel baby face. No mutton chops? Oh. Okay. No. <laughs> <laughs> Now, they've gone for the standard brows here, which is kind of the classic look. Uh, you can right. also go for something slightly bushier, get that kind of look yeah. in. Or okay. you can go like, everyone goes for the scarred eyebrow. I have a scarred but eyebrow, so I there's recognize. Always, uh, there's always always a scarred eyebrow for, for edge boys. Um, Brow ridges, if the, <laughs> that's a bit weird. <laughs> or a mono, a proper mono. Oh, God. Um... Let's go with the, oh, mm, you know what? Let's go with the pierced ones. Pierced ones? Fun with this. Oh, fun yeah. with this hair I mean, this. yeah, yeah. It was, it's 80s and 90s schlock fest. Like, we're going oh to my town. God. We can do what we like. You're, now, you're going to, you're going to hate Lua because he's, he's, he's ridiculous. Um, why would I hate a ridiculous character? You, you've met some of the characters in this campaign. Wow. Wow. How, how could it be worse? <laughs> okay. Now eyes is just whether they're humanoid or like robot and there was not a robot. So we can take that one out. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Uh, teeth. This might be important on the expression later, but I'm um, guessing relatively humanoid teeth or is there something slightly vampiric or fangy about him? He would have a slight fang. A slight fang. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. See how those come through when we do smiling in a minute, if he is smiling. But yeah, there's definitely things we can do here once we get to the expressions. Has he got horns or um, like uh, crest or anything like that? 
Uh, no. Mm -hmm. I don't think he has any of that. Expression's all down in the face now. Cool. Now, they've given him a basic humanoid body here. Mm -hmm. uh, there's also, like, uh, robotic ones, lizard-like ones, gaunt ones if he's a little bit emaciated or damaged. Mm -hmm. Anything in there that's jumping out at you that you want to change to, or do you want to stick with the basic humanoid? Uh, basic humanoid. Basic humanoid. Mm -hmm. uh, with the arms, they've got some choice of things like prostheses or um, even caps, if you're looking for that sort of thing. Uh, is both his arms in yep. place? Okay, yep. cool. Uh, it turns the legs, they've been your basic humanoid legs, but again, if you wanted clawed feet, that's an option, or even a merfolk tail. These are all options if you fancy them. No? I just thought of him as a mermaid. Oh my god. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, I think just basic human feet are fine. Great. Cool. Mm -hmm. Now, the measurements. This is where we can spend a lot of time. How tall do you think he is? Uh, he's definitely tall. He's probably like 6'2". Six 6'2". Two. Six two. Lovely. Yeah. And now the head in proportion there is slightly small for the size, so we could increase mm -hmm. the head into more of a heroic head shape. Mm -hmm. Okay, just a little bit. Just yeah. a little bit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah like right there. Yeah, gives you a bigger look. Uh, now, weight, they've got sort of medium at the moment, and you can expand mm -hmm. it out into, like, full detailing as well. Like, okay, height yeah. even lets you do a little bit there as well if we want to. Oh, okay. Um, but with the weight, are you thinking, like, slightly thinner, more waif-like, or bigger, bulkier? Mm -hmm. I kind of want to make him a thick boy. Thick boy? Is he a thick yeah. boy? Yeah. That's sort of generically thick. We can, we can make that. Okay. We can you can move that around if you want, like a bigger in the upper torso, less in the lower. Or do you want to have them all like big up, thick up? You know what? He's gonna have hips of glory. Uh, up oh. the thickness and the lower reach. Oh yeah! Look at that. Yes. 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 He's a chunky boy. Look at those yes. calves. Nice. I know, right? <laughs> Cute. Lovely. Yeah, what's it done? Oh, I took it away. I put it there. Uh, posture, I'll come back to it later. Uh, build his muscularity. Has he got any sort of muscular weight to him, or is he more of the sort of thick lad? Uh, half and half, so maybe... Mm, yeah, like right there. Yeah, a bit, of, bit, of, mm -hmm. bit more. Cool. Now, the upper scale does the um, rock effect. Uh, yeah, no. He's, no. he's definitely... He's big, definitely average. Big but not tall. Arm length tends to get us into like weird like haunt your nightmares look. No. <laughs> <laughs> Muscularity's currently up a bit. Or do you want it to be like completely dough or do you want it to have like a bit more? Just a little bit more. A little more? Yeah. yeah. Right there. Great. Lovely. He's currently got no pectorals at all. Small amount of pec. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Actually with less muscular to fish that just looks like boobs. There we go. Unless you want him to have boobs. Always an option. Um, up the bust a little bit. Up the bust a little bit. Bit of boobage. Good. Yeah. Uh, the waist is currently relatively fat out, but you can sort of fatten out the sides a bit as well, or you can go for more of that slightly thinned in. Hmm. Like in the middle. In the middle? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Now, belly does uh, weight at the front specifically, so it fattens out the front here. <laughs> Just a little belly. That one? Yeah. Uh, curves is the hips. You can curve them out even further if you want. <laughs> nah, nah. Not that much. And <laughs> booty is exactly what you would expect. Oh, he has, he has cake for days. He has cake for days. You got yes. junk? You got junk. Yep. Yep. Nice. We got junk. Cake for days. <laughs> I've never heard the word cake used in that context. It's a new one on me. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm guessing no wings or tail or fins or tortle shell or anything like yeah. that. Yeah, I think so. Right. What, is that? what does he wear? What's, what's his kind of outfit? Uh, definitely leather. Leather. Yes. Are we talking leather armor or more like leather... Um... Like... <laughs> mm -hmm. Like dejected rock star. Kind dejected of rock star leather. Do you want a coat? Do you want like a duster? Oh my god. <laughs> uh, I'll keep that in the back of my mind. Okay. I'm not sure. Okay. I'm not sure if I want something that extra. Maybe on, this is all a bit. Or what? is he that extra? Sort of thing like a like a metal leather shirt. These are probably a bit open. 
Mm-hmm. Hang on, I'm going to go to the bottom. There's more modern stuff at the bottom. I think we're going that way. That's more lab coaty. Mm-hmm. I mean, that's that's a leather jacket. That is a leather jacket right there. Ooh, okay, okay. Yeah, I like that. I like that. Uh-huh. I like that. Mm-hmm. Awesome. Let's put in some... Are we talking like leather trousers? Like <laughs> everything is stuck in? Cause we got... Everything is just uncomfortable. Yes. I mean, those look like my reaction so, pants has been much. Uh, go back up one row from where you just selected mm-hmm. and then the second one in. Oh, like these yep. ones, the little tighties. Yes. Yep. Look, look, look at the junk on that. I wow. know, it's marvelous. It's <laughs> glorious. Wow. I love it. Caboose. <laughs> All right, good. <laughs> okay, what kind of shoes go with this look? Seriously, what are we, what are we thinking? Oh, definitely boots. Boots. De- like, just, yeah. I mean, just... okay, I'm, I'm going to start at the bottom because there are some ludicrously good heels down here. Look at this shit. Look at it. Armored plate heels. I want these in real life. <laughs> Ah, yes. I need no more height, but I want them. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Look at this nonsense! Oh, oh, you you want boots? You don't you don't want this? This is me just <laughs> like that kind of boot, like a sort of high a high a high carved boot or something a bit lower. Uh, yeah, high calf is fine. Okay, let me try a couple of others. Get out of the armor section. Let me get out of the armor section. So we've got some that are a bit more, um, oh, there's a plate mail still, still in the armor section. Here we go. We've just worn old boots, nothing too special. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Or we can go a bit more, oh, there's some shaggy fur ones. Can you go back down? Uh-huh. Uh, those. These ones? Oh, tall yep. boots, proper tall. Yep, those are fine. Tall boots, tight pants. I mean, it is such a look. <laughs> please tell, please tell me he's queer as the day, because I mean, I'm, I'm, oh I'm already God, there. Have, <laughs> no oh my. Nice, good. I mean, he's, looks it. <laughs> he's a mess. He's a mess. Ooh. Just kind of sexy on side to a friend and go. One of us, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All my characters are, are, have to be queer. Of like course. they have to be somewhat queer. So funny thing is, like I feel the same way, but I think it comes out as it's more trans for me. But it still comes out as like that kind of performative queerness a little bit, which is interesting. D and D seems to be full of that kind of thing. Mm-hmm. Like, I mean, the eyebrow rings give it away already. You know. <laughs> um, <laughs> do you want gloves with this look? Oh yes, like the fingerless gloves. Oh, oh my god, god. fingerless oh. gloves. God, yes. Everyone's yes. wearing fingerless clues. <laughs> now we can put on like shoulder pauldrons and stuff. I think this outfit doesn't really work with shoulder guards, does it? That makes sense with the look. Like, why would there be shoulder mm-hmm. guards on leather jacket? Mm-hmm. But we can do like a kerchief. Oh my god. Like a bow tie. Can you, uh,. Can you click on the studded choker at the top? Of course the I first can. One? Spike. We're steering. We're really steering here. If that's what you're going for. Am I a slave? Oh Do I want God. to be? <laughs> <laughs> you know when something is just so right. That's yeah. yeah. We're sticking okay. With that. Yeah. I mean, we're gonna, someone's gonna have to tell Noir he's playing this character. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> It's fine. Just He's made like, noir. <laughs> okay, so oh, this is such a good look. Uh, what kind of gear do uh, does Luik have on him? Like, is he, does he carry any weapons at all? Um, I'd probably say like a little, uh, just a tiny little dagger or yeah. a knife or something. Mm-hmm. Um, the the main thing that he carries with him is an acoustic guitar. Show, show. Okay. Sure. So, do you want the guitar in hand, or do you want the guitar on the back? On the back. On the back, okay. Now, are we talking like a lute? Oh, sorry, that's not what we Back items. Are we talking like um, a lute, like something like that, or are we talking like, we've got a proper flying V here. Ooh, that right there. That <laughs> electric, yeah. Yeah, like a proper electric. 
Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. This character is a rogue, right? Just checking. Mm-hmm. <laughs> not suddenly made a bard and not told me. <laughs> <laughs> Now, just so you know, I'm going to have to fix the arms in a bit. I'm aware of that. We can put some spell effects on the guitar if the guitar has some magic to it. Ooh, <laughs> that's cute. Is the guitar magic? Is it a magic thing? Uh, it can be. <laughs> We're making the character. Yeah. We can put, like, that's lightning effects. We could do some, uh, like, fire effects coming out of it. Oh yeah, fire, hands down. Yeah. Uh, do we want the big fire, the medium fire, or the small fire? Let's go with the medium. Medium seems like the most, yeah, it looks like it's the most mm-hmm. even. And I'll move it around a bit so it's an impact with the ears in the same way in a minute. And then a small dagger, but at the side, not in the hands, right? You want to have the hands free. Right. Okay. Right. So, side, dagger. That's a bit big. It's a bit big too. Let's be a smaller one. Then we've got one of these uh, kukris, which is side their, their daggers for sort of slashing. Or we've got like a sort of proper stabby little, just a little stabby dagger here. Yeah, the stabby one works. Stabby one. Cool. Yeah. Oh, that's great. Okay, any sort of uh, glasses or mouth guards or rings, <laughs> piercings? Can you just 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 to humor me? Of uh, click on the click on the vented ones. I'm not saying no if you want them. If they if you want them, you have them. Uh <laughs> No, no, no. No. I mean, no. I like them. <laughs> How about this? They can be like a they can be like a secret feature. How does that have. work on a mini? How does that work <laughs> on a mini? Oh, it's a secret feature that you can't see. <laughs> okay, listen. Listen, like something that he just pulls out during the campaign whenever he feels like it. If we're going to do that, you we should have them on. Should have just them mention it. Just mention it. Oh, okay. <laughs> do you want, like, I mean, you can have a cigar, which is always a good look. I don't think, I don't think he's a smoker. Oh, okay. Is he COVID compliant? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> do, you, do you want a mask or not? Like, it's just, nah. 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 And in terms of rings, piercings, anything you want to add in on that front? Uh... You can literally do anything. I think he, I think I think I'm good with rings because he already has mm-hmm. gloves on. Uh, ooh, let's give him some earrings though. Defo, do you want um under ear? Uh, what's it called? Or, or top ear? Uh, the, uh, oh wow, wow, oh. cartilage piercing or yeah, cartilage at the top. Industrial or whatever. That's the bar. I I don't know. On um, an elf, <laughs> it comes out on the top anyway. See, because it comes in on the side there. Oh, okay. And we can also do different ones in each ear. We don't have to be bound. There can be one, okay. one in that ear. Oh, nice. Okay. Um, let's do, let's do that hoop that you just selected mm-hmm. on the right ear. Mm-hmm. And then can you go back up to the bottom? Mm-hmm. And then add the double hoops at the top to both ears. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yes. Yep. Look at some of these danglies. Look at some of these danglies, though. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, my God. He was a... Oh, my God. It's so big. <laughs> Statement piece. <laughs> it's so big. Uh... Is it a bit much? If they weren't so big. Dang it. <laughs> Let's go with the hoops. The hoops were good. We're good with yeah. the hoops. We can always make them interesting colors for that place around as well. Right, right, right. Ugh. Prettiest thick boy. Okay. Um, <laughs> so look at him. Prettiest thick boy. <laughs> okay. Now, the main thing that comes in here is pose. What do you want him to be doing in this mini? What's this look? Because there's hundreds of like preset options, and then I can tweak everything about them. Uh, okay, so you see the arms out one? And that kind of looks like Christ a little bit. <laughs> wow. Really? Oh. Not that one. Not that one. The one where his arms are like straight. Uh, oh, that two. one. Yes, that one. So that one only his 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 feet are on the ground. Yeah. And he's facing forward. 
that's the only thing I would change about that. So but flat yeah. feet on the ground and then facing forward. Mm-hmm, okay, I mm-hmm. can't flatten the feet down, but I can, if I find other feet elsewhere, use them to make that. So okay. I need flat feet on the ground together. Uh, I could do one of these and then flatten the hands out. Yeah, that works. That works too. Great. Okay. Okay, so we've got that one, and we'll use the advanced poser to... First of all, let's get the hands to be... Hang on. Yeah. So I'm doing some quick... No, you're good. Cheekies, and then I'm gonna do a twist. Do a twist. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. That sort of thing? Further out? Further in? Yeah, kind of like how that pose was where his arms are like... Oh, straight out. Yes, yeah, straight out. Okay. Try and get the right... And then get the elbow twist out so it's flat out like that. I can bend the clavicle out too. So that sort of thing, but the arm flatter, but the hand flatter? Mm-hmm. Okay. Hang on. Oh. It's all shoulder... There it is. Like that. Yeah. Is this part of your um, special magic stuff that we're not talking about yet? Maybe. Maybe. Let's <laughs> get the twist all the way out. Bend all the way across. I'll try and replicate. Should be easy enough. There we go. That elbow's a bit weird. The clavicle in a bit. Elbow's gone too far now. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we are. Like that? Mm-hmm. Looks like he's going in for a hug. Um, the expression that I have in mind will probably not say hug. <laughs> I told you, he's a mess. He's a mess. <laughs> well, here's the face. Tell me, tell me what you want. Oh, absolutely cocky. Just put it all the way up. Um, open his teeth. Yeah, and uh, up his smile a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my yeah. god! What is wrong? Yeah. Do you want the fangy teeth, or do you want us to go back and do the teeth a bit different now that we can see them properly? Yeah, let's do the teeth different. Okay, let's go back. Tooth. Just regular teeth is fine. Or, I mean, hey, let's look at all of this because we've got regular teeth for that, or we can do slightly, oh. slightly sharpened. Yeah. I mean, what says the character most for you? Because that's what's going to be the thing that drives this. Definitely, definitely fangs. The fangs. Yeah. Back of these ones, back like the proper fang fangs. Yeah, like those are fine. Would you want these ones, the sharper ones? Oh my god, it's demonic. I love it. Yeah, I think that one. Yeah, I like that one. That's terrifying. That's a serial killer, that is. <laughs> I mean, what is he doing? What's, what is he doing in this shot? you got to tell me. Uh, so, okay, okay. It'll make sense, I swear. Of course it will. Um, can you tilt his head back just a little bit? Of course. No, that's twisting it. Nope, just bending it. Tilt back. Say when? Yep, right there. <laughs> and with the hands, yeah. can you spread, can you make the fingers like spread out? Must, I, I'll like, do what I can. The hands are kind of limited because they have to be uh, relatively close together because okay. of the way printing works, but I can try. Ooh. Actually, the one, uh, go back up to the one that we just had, and then that, yeah, that one. Oh, like a front, like a full wave out? Yeah, like a, yeah. Okay. Yep. 
What is he doing? What is happening? He's entering a room. Oh, yeah. is in, is, 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 this is him kicking the door in and saying, hey, you guys. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, you guys. Perfect. <laughs> That's um, his, yeah, it's going to be his voice now. <laughs> what? <laughs> Hey, hey, you guys. Uh, hang on. I mean, I want to try and get the guitar so it's like the flames aren't like literally burning his ear off. That's better. That's better. There we go. So it's flat on his back like that. Yeah. That works. That looks so. I I don't know what you're doing. I love it, but I don't know what you're doing, and that's kind of fun. I kind of dig that a lot. That's great. And this is this is a. This is a guy who lives in hell and murders people and steals their souls, right? <laughs> Just to be clear. Something like that, yeah. <laughs> wow. How has he survived? Okay. <laughs> right, the big one. How we get this all sorted. Color. Now, there are a variety of color things we can float around with here. I tend to do it all manually because it's easier. Uh, the first thing I want to look at, though, is decals. You can do different. Okay. You can do two-tone coloration on things, and it tends mm. to make a big difference for uh, facial features and uh, hair in particular. Okay. So, for example, if you want to have two-tone hair, this is the place to do it. If you want to have like any markings, like dapples or rosettes or stripes or anything like that on the face, which is the way to do it. Okay, uh, let's do two-tone hair. Two-tone hair, definitely. Do you want like dappled across the front, or literally two-tone one and then the other, mm. or like streaks? What's the first one? Like an ombre. Okay, yeah, let's do ombre. Okay. It will add some random colors in. Don't worry about that. We can fix that later just to make sure that there's different spaces for the ombre. Okay. okay. And no other like coloration changes, nothing like that. No. No. Cool. Right then, let's get into it. We have so much choice here. Let's start Sweet. with skin tone. It's the easiest place to go. Uh, do you have a sort of common, what's known as a common skin tone, like humanoid skin tone, or do you want to go something a bit more elfy, otherworldly? Let's go with a uh, human skin tone. Oh, okay. And uh, the fifth one on the top row. That's a little too orange. Um. What's the next one after that one on the second row? The deep five. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Sort of tanned. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's cool. Oh, the skin showing is there. Yeah, I see a brown boy in my head, so. <laughs> yeah, yeah, definitely. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. uh, what sort of uh, eye color and hair color are we going here? So hair color, I was thinking uh, red and black. Like proper, like red and black, like dyed red and black, or more like a sort of, because we can go proper, like red highlights and black and over, black roots and black roots yeah. like that. Yep, just like that. Oh, brilliant! That was quick. Mm -hmm. Yay! <laughs> mm -hmm. Yep. And black on the eyebrows then, or the red on the eyebrows? Uh, black on the eyebrows. Black on the eyebrows. And in terms of eye coloration? Now, this can go uh, really weird if you want. There are some really strange ones down here, like purple or red, or even like feline or bovine or rodent eyes. Ooh. Um. What is draconic? What does that look like? Those are draconic eyes. That's necrotic. Oh, I'll get me closer. Oh, man. <laughs> That's a bad night out, that is. That's intense. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Flame also look really awesome. It's proper sour on eyes. Okay, I like those. I like those a lot. Considering that some of his powers are really, really friggin' creepy, I am A-OK -okay with him having some very unnatural elements to himself. Okay. <laughs> He's, a weird, He's a weird boy. Yeah. It's fine. Yeah. yeah, those eyes are fine. Awesome. Cool. We can always change them later if you think they're too much. Mm -hmm. um, lips, teeth. Now, lips tend to go a sort of... Hang on, we can do a deeper... Do you, do you, does he wear lipstick? I mean, do we, do we want to go that far? He doesn't. He doesn't. Okay. Now that looks. That's pretty sort of normal lips. I don't think too major on that. Okay. And then teeth. There's a very standard white teeth. 
-hmm. There's also the yellow teeth of someone who does not live very well. Oh god. There's, including like mine, there is the bloody teeth of someone who eats things he probably shouldn't. And then there's like the crumbling teeth, like the oh, old school. Oh god. He's a pretty boy. He takes care of himself. So okay, let's give him the white teeth. Pearlies. Okay. <laughs> No problemo. All right. Well, that's all of the sort of big feature pieces done. That's good. We can then move on to the the outfit. Like it's a black. It's a leather coat. Is it black leather? Is it brown leather? It's black leather. Now, Definitely. is it like proper, like sticky, like sort of rock star leather? Mm hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Then I'm going to recommend we go for the uh, glossy here because that looks. Oh no, I've gone too far. Hang on. That's the shirt. I'll get that back to the white. Let's use bone for now. Interesting. Interesting. It seems to think that those pieces are not part of. Ah, oh, okay. It's, it's it's black. It's a black. Um, it's a black uh, waistcoat. That's why. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Do you like the waistcoat? We can change it. Um, let's try to find like a biker. Biker. <clears throat> sure. Yeah, like a biker jacket. I thought that was one whole thing, but it's hard to tell in the gray, obviously. Okay. I mean, a biker jacket. I'm sure they have something like that. So. Nice lab coats, but too far. Do, do, do. Okay, we're into armor now, so we need to go back all the way up to the top for some of the more. Hmm. Come on, leather jacket. There must be it. No, it goes back into armor again. Hmm. No, it's just white, so that's wrong. Um, I think the closest we came was the trench earlier. Um. Actually, I think I just saw something. Scroll back down. Mm -hmm. uh, keep scrolling. Keep scrolling. Mm -hmm. All the way down. Oh, sorry. Okay. No, you're good. You're good. Uh, stat. Oh, uh, uh, this one. Uh, go, uh, go back up like two. One. Like two rows. Two. One more. One. Go up one more. Just row. leaving that there. Just, just for your consideration. <laughs> um. So the top row, second one. What is that one? That is an elven chest piece. <laughs> It looks like a, it looks like a, um, like a Michael Jackson s. It does, doesn't it? It looks kind of yeah. jacket. Do you want to, do you want to keep it? Yeah. Cool. Then what I'll do is I will make it look like black leathers for you. I know how to do that because okay. I can use. Oh no, I can use a, um, a sort of a slick black gloss to give it that really like horrible black leather yeah and then put, oh my God. put the paneling in like the, putting the paneling in white really says like it's big and different but we could put the paneling in something like um like a sort of slick again because slick colors tend to work for leather like mm -hmm, it could be mm -hmm. like do you want to have a color statement on this more of the Kinda, red yeah. more of the red yeah yeah more the red oh, oh my god i've been oh to hell god. and i liked it <laughs> <laughs> i mean that is a biker jacket and a half that, isn't it look at that that is oh my god yeah yeah <laughs> wow. this is oh my god Love okay it. do you want to um, go for the um sort of leather pants to go with it yeah, just black leather pants. Isn't is it the same piece? Is it like the same outfit? Yeah. Okay, so well, yeah, that that, that material is fine. Okay, and then we'll do what? What do you want the belt to be in? Uh, I'm not really picky on the belt. Okay. Uh, it can either be black or like a dark brown or something like that. Well, do we want it to be part of the same look? And then we can put the studs. Yes. Okay. So we'll put it as part of the oh, same okay, look. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we'll do the studs in. Again, if it's the same outfit. Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, look at that ass. Jesus. Okay. How does that tie in with the boots? I want the boots and the gloves to sit with that. Because this looks like biker gear. This looks like someone who has walked in, like, just off their Harley. Hmm. I think just traditional. I, mm, I can see the gloves being black. Definitely. Mm. Just like a standard. Let's leather. go with a slightly less. Like more of a leather look, because then they're a different yeah, piece than a part yeah, of the jacket, yeah. you know? Can you put that on the boots and see what it looks like? Of course. And we can vary that up a bit if you like, because that's currently a very single tone. I think a, mm -hmm. a second tone for the inside Ooh. will give that a bit I of really zing. Like that color. And then I'll use the black on the... It's nice to repeat the color mix that you're using elsewhere. It really highlights it where it is, so that can then mm -hmm. be on the buckles. And then we'll use the red blood plate on those again. And then it looks like it's part of the same look. Yeah. 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 Awesome. I'll just do the soles of the shoes as well, because I keep forgetting that. Awesome. I mean, that is an outfit. Damn. <laughs> this nightmare I like human. I have to draw him. This like... nightmare human. Oh my god. He's not even a human, this nightmare elf. Okay, um, the piercings. There are so many of them. Do you want different colors on all of them, or do you want like a style or a theme? Are they a hot mess? Uh, gold on the ears. Gold on the ears. Like a proper radiant gold? Yeah. Or like a tarnished gold? Ooh, what does a tarnished one look like? Yeah, find it. There we go. That's yeah, more tarnished. I mean, it looks much the same to me. Okay. What do you want around the um, top band? Can you do the one above that, the brass? Yeah. See what that looks like? Mm-hmm. Ooh, I like that better. Put that on the gold as well? Yeah. Cool. What about the eyebrow rings? Uh, eyebrow rings are black. More of the, um, like the black against the black eye, the against the black eyebrows might fade a little bit. Okay. I mean, it's um, there, but it... What's the, what's the one below that one? The dark chrome looking. Chromey. Okay. You yeah, that stands out. It looks lighter, or is that fine? That stands out. Yeah, it looks different. And the thing is, it, <laughs> sorry, every time you do it, uh, it <laughs> looks it looks different. Like it, it really separates them mm -hmm. out a bit, which is the good thing. Okay. Okay, this guitar, like, talk yeah. to me. What do you want? Ah, uh, what am I thinking? What am I mm -hmm. thinking? I feel like oh, I hell. almost feel like this guitar needs to just be offset from everything that he's wearing. Like just something crazy. Green? Like a pastel color. Oh, pastel. Okay, no problem. Uh, right, pastel green. I can do that. Like you don't expect him to have this color. I'll use the, the some great plant greens in there. How about that? Hmm. Do you have any light blues? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, ye of little faith, do you have any light blues? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, why am I doing this to him? Um, it's great. It's great. <laughs> uh, what about like a lilac, like a light purple? I like that. Yep, cool. Yeah, what like kind that. of tone for the metal bits of the guitar? Do you want to go completely off the wall compared to everything else and make it like a sort of proper chromed silver? Ooh, yes. So it's very different from everything else that he owns? Yeah. Awesome. Okay, I've done all those pieces now. Oh, hang on, hang on. I need to have an offset. There needs to be a, The offset needs to be a purple metal because if you were making a guitar like that, you'd have an offset purple metal. And then that needs to be a wood. Sorry, I'm just talking to myself, but I think mm -hmm. I've got the pieces here. Yeah, 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 yeah. How do we like them apples? Yes. Now the yep. flames. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, 
What, what are, are they? Are they part of the um, strange necromantic energy that he uses? Mm-hmm. 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 How do we feel about steering into that skid with something a bit dark and mysterious and maybe a little bit awful? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm going to use some actual flat paint. I think it's going to work better. What I want is yes, latex. There you are. Oh yes. Weird, yes. like sort of necrotic flame. Yes. That looks awful. I love it. Hang on, do we want white to black? I think we want white to black. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Just the yep. dagger left, I think. Yeah, cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Let's get this dagger. I'm going to try and use the same colors as elsewhere. Yeah. Just so it runs in the same sort of pattern and design. There we go. Anything about that you want to tweak? Nope. He's perfect. How do I spell Lua? L U A. Okay. <laughs> now, for those watching who are looking at Lua going, is Lua some kind of bard? No. No, Lua He's is. Not. Lua is the world's most horrific rogue. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. He's amazing. He looks so out of this world odd. It's just. Excellent. Great, Bree. Thank you so much for making Lua with me. That's that's brilliant stuff. I cannot wait oh, to see God. him in Agents of the Nine Hells. Redux. Awesome. It's going to be, be interesting. Good. It's going to be interesting is what it's going to be. Definitely. I love mm -hmm. it. Cool. Mm -hmm. Well, join us for Agents of the Nine Hells. Redux. Uh, that will be in January 2021 for... Um, uh, roll together uh, on Tuesdays, 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. Uh, GMT, uh, 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. PT. And come and see Lua in action. Bree, thank you so much. Looking forward to January. Yeah, same. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. See you soon. Bye.